I'm a whore for stage time, so thank you. Uh, how's everybody doing tonight? Cool. My name's Andrew Ingram. I tell jokes. My jokes are like my kids. Fucking hate them. Uh, I'm kidding. I don't have any kids. Uh, by the way, that would be funnier if I had said, I don't have any jokes. Uh, we'll get it next time. I heard you call it. I don't have jokes. Hey, Arthur. <laughs> Thanks for the $50 you gave me last week. Uh, you got to keep the relationships tight, you know, even when people are being an asshole. They paid you once, they might pay you again. Exactly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what, the, what the hell is a double dog dare? What does that mean? Like, Please don't be a bitch. It means don't be a bitch. All right. Yeah. Like, if I'm not a bitch, do I get two dogs? Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. I would do a lot of stupid shit for two dogs. What? I've done the math. I've run the numbers. I would drink a glass of my own pee for two yeah. dogs. Woo. I would. Okay. I would. You know. You know. You know why? You know who doesn't care that you just drank a glass of your own pee? How hurt are the dogs? A couple of dogs, you're goddamn right. It's the only joke in my arsenal I want you to get ahead of me on. Uh, and it's the only one you get to shout out the punchline first, okay? If you get it, keep it to yourself. Let it be a surprise for the rest of the group. Uh, they ain't all as smart as you are, buddy. But they're going to enjoy it more if it comes from me. Uh, <laughs> let's see, uh, let's tell another stupid one. I think when life gives you lemons, you should just throw them at your stepdad's truck. You know? <laughs> it's like, who's she going to believe, Greg? She already knows you're cheating with Aunt Barbara. You know, my parents are happily married. They have been for 36 years. It's wonderful. Uh, but sometimes it's funny to write mean jokes. Yeah. You know, like a girl, uh, I, I asked her out uh, a couple weeks ago, and she told me she'd think about it. And I think we all know when a woman says, I'll think about it, what she means is, uh, please don't murder me in the alley. Uh, Apropos of nothing, if, if anyone happens to have like uh, a large plot of land or a, I don't know, a tub full of acid, I have Venmo, so. <laughs> That's the most exploded joke I've written in like five years. I don't like it, uh, for the record. Yeah, it's so good. It's, I, I know. That's what's terrible. It's like, God damn, that's a good joke. I don't feel good telling it. Oh, man. Uh, I don't really know what I want from a relationship, right? Like, I, I don't... I, I've been single for a little while now, and I just, I still don't know what I, what kind of woman I, I'm, I, I'm really attracted to. I know what kind of woman likes me, and that's lesbians who are mean to me. Uh, <laughs> it's like, I don't know, he's got the right politics and he'll throw me around, but I could probably take him in a fight. <laughs> Uh, this is fun. <laughs> You're all, good. There's no I know I'm good. Thank you. Uh, I appreciate the compliment. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> nice beer. Thank you. Woo! Is it that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> You're You're all right, I get it now. We we can talk after the show. All right. Uh, okay. uh, tell me to buy you a beer, and I'll be meeting you later. Uh, uh, <laughs> good. God bless. That's that's a good trait in a in a it person. Is. It's yeah. Uh, it's good news too because I'm an artist. I can't afford beer. Uh, <laughs> Here comes this motherfucker yeah. with a guitar again. So yeah. thank yes, God. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing now. Uh, <laughs> Hey, uh, 
on your way out from the venue tonight, you know, if you see like a really fancy car, just, you know, pee it. 